All right, what's up, everybody? We're back with new Need for Speed Heat customization. And today we are going to do the Audi S5. This car was in payback. I like the way it looked, I like the way it sounded. So let's see if they improved it. I hope so, because this car was so nice. So we're going to start off with the front bumper. Basic. Oh, all basic stuff, to be honest. Nothing really impressive. So we're just going to slap the second one on. Ooh, we can change the grill. Black. Got to black it out. You already know how to do it. Splitter. I don't want a huge dinner plate on this thing. I just want a nice small one. On some cars, I would put a fat dinner plate, though. Just going to black out the headlights now. All the basic stuff. You always got to black them boys out. Front fender. There's nothing that really sticks out that far. Because in the last game, white body. It's crazy. Side skirt. Kind of basic side skirts. Not much. So we're just going to put that one on. Rear fender. Kind of the same thing. There's not really much to it. They're kind of all basic. So we're just going to put that on. Tail light. I think we're going to keep the regular ones because I don't want one part to be black and one part to be red. So we're just going to keep the regular lights, I guess. License plate. Change that to the shameless plug. You, you guys should sub, by the way, just so you guys know. Spoiler. We're going to check out these big wings. Don't really want a chassis mount on this car, at least. I would go for a... Uh, a big fat wing though and now that's what i need a dinner plate i'm gonna put that one of those big boys on voltex yeah diffuser want a little one there's our only little ones which is good nothing too meaty rear bumper more basic nothing really cool i guess exhaust honestly i would put one of those big pipes if i was just crazy but i think we're just gonna put a normal small big boy on actually it's not even small it's a big boy right there now for rims i think i have an idea of what i want to go for it's probably the uh the cosmos they're the, the cosmos lines are really cool in my opinion not gonna lie so i'm gonna put these bad boys on Gotta change the tires, Toyo, Speed Hunters, NFS, Kumo. I think I'm just gonna go for the Toyo tires. Can't go wrong with Toyo. Brake discs. Wait, it disappeared. Hm. Is there supposed to be something there? I'm gonna go for the little lines in the bad boy. And you gotta put on the red Brembos. You cannot make a car without the red brembos now we just gotta look for the same rims those kind of look the same don't really i think it's that one yeah i think it's that one matches slap it on tires i'm gonna put the toyos on i wish i could see the tire riding in the back just to make sure gotta put on the brembos again There they are. Now, paint. I think we're just going to black it out for now before I actually find out um, a color for the car. Then we'll probably just match it. Tire profile. I'm just going to make it the biggest. Make it black. Black that bad boy out. Going to do it for the same for the other side. Apply. Oh, don't know why I did that. Yep, make them bigger again. Wow, that looks weird, but whatever. Just gonna wait till I find a color for the car. Wing mirrors, just gonna add that one. Hood, gotta add the venti boys, gotta add them vents. The car needs to breathe. Now we gotta find a paint. And I want a Miami style kind of paint like some like light blue or maybe some pink 
kind of give that Miami vibe because this game does take place in Miami or I think it takes place in Miami. I would do the normal cyan, but I want to try something new and probably try out the, the effects where when you move your camera, the uh, paint changes. So I'm just looking at these materials, seeing which one I really want. I think I'm just gonna go to where it was originally. Ooh, that pink actually matches nicely. Oh, okay. Gotta get that blue pink Miami vibe. If you guys don't know what Miami subs is, it kind of has that color. So that's what I'm going for, the Miami subs. Now I'm just gonna change the rim color to make it the same as the uh, the car paint. Honestly, I should have put carbon fiber, but I'm just not gonna do that for this one. Change the effect. Yep, there we go. Gotta get the blue and pink. Add them boys. Apply. And now I gotta change the black to what the what the other color is. I have to. I'm gonna try to get it the same, but it's probably not gonna work out that great. Gonna slightly move the uh, the slider. Kind of seems like that's what it was before. Let's get the effect. All right, that looks like it. I guess. All right, let's get it. You gotta apply. Now we are going to slam it. Let's go to two in stance. Gotta slap that boy all the way down to the ground. Mm, yeah, just drop it completely. Add a teeny tiny bit of camber. Don't want too much or else it'll just look whack. Just a little teeny tiny bit so you barely notice it. And you gotta, oh, forgot to black out the, uh, the window tint. I do that real fast. Window tint, black. Now wrap. Now I just want a simple sticker on the front window. Gonna look for something that matches with the paint of the car. And I'm gonna slap that bad boy on. Well, as I'm looking for that, I hope you guys enjoy. This video's almost done. Honestly, I'm having fun making these cars for Need for Speed, and I just cannot wait for this game. I just, I can't wait to play it. I'm gonna play it all day, every day. I'm probably gonna live stream the campaign, because why not? So yeah, boys, if y'all enjoyed, leave a like, please, and get my name out there. It'd be really lit, to be honest, just to get more people to find out who I am, even though I'm kinda nobody i guess but yeah if you guys want more need for speed stuff let me know i still have some cars to do i haven't made them all yet so yeah hope you guys enjoyed bye